Okay, Derek, so into the NCAA sem or finals again. Uh, I don't know if we're going to have a familiar opponent. Sounds like it. Yeah. Um, I know you don't care. You just want to wrestle whoever they put in front of you. But yeah. going out there, um, winning a tough sum summer, right? Yeah. How many times have you guys wrestled this year? That is actually the first time I've ever wrestled. Ever? Oh, that kid, yeah. In all of this? Yeah, in all of this. And he's Believe been in not. the bracket a couple of times. He's yeah. an All-American. You're a finalist. I think he's the only one that I haven't wrestled yet. <laughs> How good does it feel, though, to knock them off? Well, it feels great. I mean, I, I definitely, like, I want to wrestle everybody. I'd wrestle everybody in the bracket if I had to. So it feels great. In real time, we just hear it. Dalton Abney, you guys are, it's the third time meeting the NCAA Finals, correct? Yep, it is. You're the runner-up twice. What do you got to do to flip that result and make third time a charm? I love it. I mean, uh, Coach told me this year, earlier, when we started the year, that he was coming back. Couldn't be more excited. I want him in there. Um, I want it the tough way, uh, so I'm just going to have to turn it on, get to my stuff. Uh, really all this uh, consistency, um, I owe a lot to my coaches and, and my teammates, um, without them I totally wouldn't be where I am, so uh, all the glory to them and also to God, uh, just really have a lot to be thankful for. Was Doug your grandfather? Yeah, yeah, Doug was my grandfather. So Doug, and Doug Blueball was an interesting character. I'm sure you could share that with people. I knew him. He used to come to our practices when I was in junior high. Yeah. What do you think he would think of your college career? I hope he'd be proud of me. Uh, you know, I, I wrestle for myself, but it definitely feels good having uh, him looking over my shoulder. Uh, kind, of, kind of a nice gesture. Do people ask you about that a lot? Is he a, a focal point of a lot of like articles and, and, and stories about you? Yeah, I get a lot of questions. Um, I think people know back home. And then when I come out here, especially out west towards the Oklahoma area where he was from, I get a lot of questions from people that know. And, and he's, he's, he passed in a motorcycle accident just down, like in between here and Oklahoma City, right? Yeah, correct. Yeah. How long has he been gone? Uh, it's been about 12 years. 12 years? So you were a little guy. Yeah, I was little. Do you remember it? Very little. I, so remember just, him, I remember him coming to visit and uh, sitting down on the couch. And he had narcolepsy. You'd see how much I had grown. He'd pass out on the couch and fall asleep. Um, I like, barely remember that, but uh, then I obviously remember going to his, his viewing and all that stuff. But uh, yeah, I wish I had more memories with him, but I'm glad for the ones that I did have. I remember he would do a flexed arm hang and fall asleep. Was the, am, I, am I making that out, right? Do you remember? Did he ever do that for you? No, he never did that for me, but I've heard plenty of stories. Um, which is kind of the best part about having him as my grandpa. I just get to hear stories everywhere I go. It's like myth and folklore. Yeah. Right? I love hearing it. Uh, got anything else? Congratulations. Thanks. Good luck for the, the, the third time against Dalton Abbey in the NCAA Finals. I appreciate it very much.